Hello, this is Matthew Mead and this is a video highlighting the new user features within Axis Camera Station 5.45. As always, please take a look at the release notes to view the full extent of this release. In this release, we have improved feedback in several places. The first is that you can now easily check the current status of Axis services from the login page. This can be useful in identifying temporary issues with secure remote access and our license system. The next area of improvement is when you're upgrading Access Camera Station. You can now view a dialog box which informs you of all of the stages taking place. You can also view this dialog box within the server service control. Another addition is the display of the ports used by Axis Camera Station. There is also a link that will take you directly to the ports section within the user manual. And this identifies all of the ports used within Axis Camera Station. A useful addition to data search is that we can now display images. In this example, we can see Access Control cardholder images displayed. This can be really useful when reviewing footage and verifying a person within the video recording. Finally, I'd like to highlight the integration of the Axis M5000 PTZ camera. This camera has three fixed cameras and a PTZ camera. The camera requires one license and is easily integrated into Axis Camera Station. You can configure the camera by using the panoramic view, which places the PTZ at the top of the screen and three fixed at the bottom. An operator can simply click on one of the fixed views and the PTZ will move to that area. As this camera only requires one network connection, this is a really efficient way of covering an area. I hope you found this video of interest. Thank you for watching.